The fan-shaped deposit is called a delta, named for its often triangular shape. A delta is caused by the rapid slowing of fresh water as it enters the ocean, causing a pileup of sediment to form. The delta contains brackish water from the mixture of fresh and salt water. Special and unique mixtures of species occur here that can tolerate these harsh conditions. Water from the main river channel fans out into a network of small channels called distributaries, which fan out into the shoreline. Muddy to sandy bars can be found in between these channels and are an example of new land being formed today. Shape is an important way we classify types of deltas. Not all deltas are the same. Some deltas have a high amount of river sediment pouring into the sea, like the Mississippi. Others have little sediment, and may be largely shaped by ocean waves or tides. These types of deltas give scientists clues on how the coastline was formed. Let's conduct an experiment to see if we can create a delta in GeoGarage. Let's try to make a river delta in our backyard table. You'll need sand, water, and black felt. This time we will make our area lower in elevation and larger in size. We pour water in the whole pile to simulate the effect of clays and their ability to hold sediment together tightly. As we pour, notice the shapes in the sand that the water makes. We don't see meanders here because the grains are too coarse and the slopes are too steep. But over time we see our delta forming in the ocean along the edges of our pile of sand. You can see smaller versions of deltas all around you if you look closely. Wherever sediment-filled streams rapidly slow down, such as at the base of a hill, you can often find little deltas forming. We can follow this little delta, this little river channel that came out after a recent storm. The water has flowed down and picked up sediment as it moved quickly down the hill, eroding into the shale below. And here, as it exits this little canyon, it slows down. And it can't hold that sediment in any longer, and it just dumps it into this fan-shaped pile full of beautiful, beautiful sedimentary features like bars and channels, point bars, cut banks, all sorts of features that mimic things that you see on scales hundreds of miles wide.